Hi Scorpio, well if you've come this far, that means that you've become a member. Thank you for becoming a member and I hope you will enjoy your double readings. So you will have four extra readings per month and other perks, like when I go live with members and then it will only be for members and then you can ask questions and I'll give you the answers. I'll be doing this once a month and you can get a reading of four card reading which is worth $4.99 okay that said let's get to the next level the next level entails the magician that's the first card your energy and your vibes are high this month and definitely this week magician magic mean, means magic Magic is in the air. It also means that he represents Aries and Gemini. And number one, it means a new beginning. You hold the magic. You hold the key to your own life's path and your own life's decisions and choices and magic. So make magic. You've got the tools. You've got the know-how. You've got the gifts. Use them don't create illusions then you won't have disillusions so then you won't be depressed and expectations won't be dithered the next card is the butterfly the three of wands and the hermit the hermit is number nine nine is an ending where there is an ending there is a new beginning that also confirms that the three of wands is right that there will be a new beginning because plans are coming to fruition and abundance is coming in. The truth will be revealed. That is the key word on the Hermit's card. The Hermit also represents Virgo, so you could be dealing with a Virgo or meeting a, a Virgo. And there will be a change for the better, like the butterfly has stated. You might want to do some meditation, contemplation and evaluation so that you will sit down quietly in a sacred place and the answers always will come to you because the answer is all usually within you on what to do in a certain situation or with a question at hand or what is happening with you now. So take rest with, through meditation, contemplation every day or when you're seeking an answer also you could be asking somebody that you love trust and respect that has life knowledge and life experience to guide you with something he is also known as a guide usually a spiritual guide perhaps you might be seeking spiritual guidance this could be through somebody that's mature and older than you or somebody that you trust and respect or even a professional. The torch um, and the knight of wands, underneath that we have the justice card. The justice card also speaks of balance. The justice card represents Libra. This has also got the number 11, like I told you in the weekly, with the porthole with the lizard spirit. So here you've got these two sprogs, the number 11, the archway, the doorway to a new beginning. The angels have your back. If you are in a judicial situation, justice will be done. You will get what you deserve and so will the other. Now you could be trying to balance your heart, your mind, your body and your so solar plex. Um, you might be trying to balance, like I've been with the two of pentacles. So this does resonate throughout um, the reading, balance, balance, getting, um, going within, getting everything balanced and ready and rested up before the festivities begin. The cane. The Page of Cups, we underneath that, we have the Wheel of Fortune. 
Again, karma. Karma will be returned to you threefold. Whether you've done good or bad. If somebody's done you good or bad, then karma will be brought back to them threefold as well. Again, the Taurus, Leo, Scorpio and other Scorpio. This can be you, but I think it's another Scorpio or an Aquarius uh, could be around you or could be coming into your life. This card means that the wheel is turning upwards. You're leaving negativity behind and moving on to better things. Also confirming the magician and the ace of uh, pentacles, that things are becoming better. This could mean a promotion, a wage rise, definitely recognition. Also, you could be getting engaged, getting married, starting a family or expanding the family. This can be with a baby, but it can also be with a domestic pet. You could be trying, uh, uh, you could be um, moving home or going on holiday. Luck is with you. That is also the keyword on the wheel. It is number 10. So here you've got another number one. With the 11, the one, one from the justice card, you've got the triple one, the angelic number. The angels are definitely showing you that they are here. We have also got judgment. Judgment is a new beginning or a second chance, a reconciliation perhaps for some of you. This means also to me that you are the phoenix rising from the ashes and there are decisions to be made with the justice card, luck with the wheel and judgment means that there is an outcome. So the outcome will most probably be very magical because you will have to make a choice or a decision. And the truth will be out and the justice will be done. I hope you've enjoyed this reading, my sweet Scorpio. And remember, dream the world into being and that relates to the hermit it relates to the the justice card and the two of pentacles balancing your emotions your intuition your ideas with all in one mind body and soul and the solar plex i hope you've enjoyed this reading and i hope you will have a lovely week and i would say Fly, reach for the sky because you're going to triumph. Feel free like a bird. Take care. Bye-bye.